All right, hi guys, welcome back to Circus Play Subnautica, episode thirty-five. We have just apparently. <gasps> what is going on? That was interesting. Okay, so apparently there's a weird glitch with the water. We're fine though. Took some damage. We're a-okay. So my next question: is Can we scan those things? We cannot. All right. So here's where we're at. We built this outpost that I'm a little sketched out by, if I'm going to be real with you. That's not the right button. I... We still have some raw materials on the Cyclops. Let's do this real quick, though, if we can. I would assume that this thing was going to falter. It already would have. We should have brought lubricant with us, but we did not. Let's grab the rest of our titanium. I, I, I've i been on this kick of wanting to build a moon pool down here to house the prawn suit. This way we can bring the cyclops. If we need to leave, we can ferry ourselves with the sea moth. But, you know, I have a decent swim in front of us and not have to bring the cyclops in here. I think, truth be told, we're, over, we're overthinking it. We're going to need these guys. And we're going to need our lithium. All this stuff is meant to come down here. Uh, you know what? We've got plenty of food just in general. We're not at all hurting for that. So... Mm, okay. I'm just trying to just trying to get my bearings here. Let's get this set up because we're not going to be on board for a while. Okay. That locker's empty. Delicious bubble fruit. I was going to say I think that tree's not long for this world. Okay, so all the raw materials we brought are going to go into the outpost. I'm going to attempt to reinforce it. It's just making a weird noise. I don't think it matters. It's also built pretty far below this, the surface, so I mean, you, you know, what can you do? But, like I said, it's bothering me, so... Okay, I think we're good. Good. The one thing that we cannot do down here, which may eventually be an issue, is make water. And I should have thought of that. So... We need bleach. It's been a while since we made bleach. We need salt and coral too. Okay. So we're going to have to come back. And no matter how we do this, we're coming back. We're, we're By coming back, I mean we're going to go to the homestead and come back. Okay. So you're going to get a full power cell. What else is in here? Battery and a power cell. Okay, perfect. We're going to charge up this puppy. Welcome aboard, Captain. We're going to grab a ton of water. I don't think we need the med kits, but what we do need is the water. As long as we have water for what we're going to do in the prawn suit, in fact, let's just bring a ton of it. I don't know how long we're going to be down there. As long as we have enough water for that, and we should probably bring food with us, which is all in the Cyclops, of course, I think we'll be okay. We honestly don't need to bring anything else. In fact, we won't even need to leave the prawn suit, probably, as far as I know. Okay. So this is all food that is ready to go, and truth we'll be told, we don't even need that much. All right, I think we're ready to rock. By ready to rock, we're going to explore these caves. So let's save the game and get into the prawn suits. Welcome aboard, Captain. 
and down we go. So we're going to have to make a decision if we want to go left or right first. I think we're going to go left. What do we have here? Titanium? We will take titanium. I don't know what we have at the homestead. I do know we're lacking titanium and probably copper, so that's what we're looking for. I don't need... I don't know how much more kyanite, uraninite, rubies, magnetite, whatever other types you got. I don't know how much more we need of that stuff. But we do need copper and titanium. That I do know. So we know how to get out. Is this the left path? Actually, let's go down. Why don't we do that? We've upgraded our crush depth. I think last time... Wait, 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 wait. So we know that the base is at like 800 meters or some such. So we probably don't need to go down. I hope we're in the right area. What the... Get out of here. Copper ore. We definitely want this. I'm not going to sit here drilling the whole time. But I am going to drill this puppy. Man, that feels good. I'll tell you what, we can always come back for more of that. Is this even a pathway? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so I guess that means we're going down. I, I, I do hope we're in the right area. I kind of just blindly read that this is where we should go. Looks like we've got more titanium. Well, here's a good chance to check our storage. You know what, dude? You're causing problems for yourself. Okay, in we go. Down we go. It looks like there's only one real path here. I could be wrong. This could open up into something. Or I could have missed something. So the last area we were in, two episodes ago now, that was pretty crazy. And we saw some stuff down there that I'd like to never see again, but I feel like we might see more of down here. What is this? I believe this guy has copper. Taking beacons wouldn't have hurt. Excuse me. We kind of got to go up a little, I feel. Is 
I'm actually kind of worried about our depth. Like, I hope we're going the right way. Those warpers creep me the hell out. Okay, looks like we've got a lot of good natural resources down here. Also looks like we're making some kind of headway into some kind of antechamber. I don't like this at all, but... I hope we don't have to get up there. If we have to get up there, uh. Maybe there's an escalator? I don't know. Okay, so I wonder if we're in the same area because that's our friend from last time. Well, so I think what we're going to do while we have a, a natural break is repair this guy. If I can stasis him, I'm not afraid of him. Not at all. Maybe a little. I mean, this seems different than everything else, so. I don't like those leeches. I hate those leeches. Those leeches are by far my least favorite enemy in this game, I think. Uh, I take that back. It's, it's definitely the warper. I, I do believe, though, that we've killed a decent amount of things. The only thing that we haven't really killed, killed, sorry, is a, uh, any type of Leviathan. I'm also always wary of like grappling hook things in games where like what if we end up in a place that we're not supposed to be. It does look like there's plenty of drillable resources down here though so I'd assume we're okay for now. And I guess we have to get to a depth of like 800 meters. we go up it's hard to tell I don't think so hmm now the other thing is I don't really know where I came up it doesn't look like this is anything other than some kind of formation okay so that's probably the direction we came down there so I guess we got to go in the direction of our big friend hello Am I stuck to that warper? I am. Peace, dude. Peace. Okay, so we have not seen this skeleton. I've lost kind of track of where that big thing is, and <clears throat> I'm not too happy about that, but 
I don't think there's anything to do about that. Oh. Okay, so we don't... Oh, no. We don't want to fall down there. We seem to want to go up. He also doesn't seem that dangerous. I don't... I don't know if I really want to... Jinx that. Okay, well, it looks like there's a path kind of going up here, so... I mean, I, I assume we're looking for one of those, like, alien facilities that we've seen a few of. Not the sea bases, but the other guys. So I think we'll know it when we see it. This looks like it could be a path of sorts. We've got plenty of power. This seems like a dead end, eh? Fair enough. I mean, I can't shake the feeling that this... ...thing in the center is where we gotta go. I'm about to stasis the hell out of that thing. I'm not going to lie. I'm So what I do know, and this is slight spoilers, but if we're at this point together, then, uh, you know, we kind of, we're in it for the long haul, right? I know that there's, God damn it. You gotta do this to yourself, man. I think he's dead. What I'm worried about is getting teleported out when that other guy is floating around. Okay. And again, we just need enough water to get back. But anywho, I do know that there's two lava zones, okay? I know that we have to go to one and then the other. I don't know if we're in the right zone or last time or if we're in the same zone or there's just one zone and they're kind of segregated. All I know is that we probably have to, at some point, find a way to go up. And it does look like there's a lot above us. It actually looks like there's islands above us. Mm. Is there more than one of these things? I swear I just saw one over there. I don't I don't know if I'm a big fan of that. Yeah, like I bet we have to get up there. Hmm. Have I been bamboozled? Why is this so red? My bro. So maybe we do have to Spider-Man our way up. But then I guess my question is, what would you do if you didn't have the grappling arm? I believe the prawn suit... I don't like how you sneak up on me. I believe the prawn suit always has the jets. There's a lack of hostility from this guy. He's about to throw a fireball or something, I think, but... I honestly think that the... the reapers are... more aggressive. We may have to 
RTB and kind of reassess what we're doing with our lives, you. Because I, I, I feel as though we have to get up there. Assuming that's not some weird rendering thing and those are actually platforms. It could be wrong, though. You know what? Nothing in this game is that scary. When you have this friggin' prawn suit, it's all good to go. It's all good to go. Okay, well, I wonder if this thing gets any cool radio stations. In serious, I. He's, Sirius XM. I am convinced that we can get up there somehow. Which isn't really helping my confidence. So this is... Where is... Okay. As long as we have the reference point of... Oh, hello. Hello. As long as we have the reference point of the Cyclops and our summer home, we're okay. I don't know if we've been this way. I think we've got a couple options for our, our second voyage. So, uh, this is the plan, I believe. We're going to explore this way, and if we don't find a hint of anything, we're probably going to have to go back to our base and plan out another trip. And if we do that with our newfound copper ore, we can beacon it out and figure out exactly where we are. That's silver. We actually probably do need some silver. Bro. That's honestly probably enough. I'm seeing warpers, I'm seeing. Uh... So it looks like that's the edge of things. I'm not unconvinced that we don't have to do something with this spire-looking structure. I also wonder if we can stasis this dude's fireballs. That would be pretty clutch, right? See, it looks like there's like another structure on top of it, but I don't think that there is. And then all of a sudden that thing is just behind you. I think he went this way though. And I do think there's more than one, so. I'm just, I'm not unconvinced about that centerpiece. Is this where we came down last time? I don't think so. As long as we're up here. This does kind of 
feel like where we came down last time. Uh, let's let's do this. Let's get some beacons. What else do we have? We have Vincent Rubies was the one that I think we used. That or the. I'm not gonna lie to you, that doesn't really tell me anything. I thought we had another beacon. This is this is feeling familiar though. I mean that'd be above us, eighteen hundred meters. I mean who knows, right? We did have a very tough time with things down here, so... Uh, I'm confused. I, I actually have uh, the vibe that this... That's not good. I actually do have the vibe that this is where we... came in the first time. Because he wasn't far off from us the first time, right? Like, like we did encounter him. Now that is deep. Okay. I'm going to tell you what. We're going to check out this center area one more time to see if there's anything we missed. And beyond that, I, I think we're going to have to scratch this one and just reassess and figure it out. That's some Apex Legends Pathfinder grappling. That was not, okay. I mean, we're looking for the thermal plant, right? That makes me think we're looking for an actual structure. I, I can't imagine they would have you grappling up this stupid cliff. All right, let's 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 recharge. Let's just chill. Let's look around. Do we see anything? Well, there is kyanite right there, so maybe they do want you to climb climb this damn thing. It's a little wild, but. Uh, we can drop. I mean, maybe we shouldn't be looking for a building so much as we should be looking for one of those, like, force fields. It's 
So maybe we're going about this all wrong. Maybe, well, we do need to get to 800 meters. So that, that, that's the other issue, is we're probably not even in the right area. It, in, in fact, maybe where we should be looking is where I said we came in last time. Maybe that's actually the right spot. I want to fight this stupid thing. Probably a bad idea, though. Yeah, so we're... All right, well, I'll tell you what. I think this is going to end the episode. Uh, we're going to end it here. But next time, we're going to come back with vengeance and figure out exactly where we need to go. I don't want to look it up, but I am kind of tempted to, only because I feel like we could be running around here, and I don't think we're in the right area. So what exactly do we have to get to? We have to get to, let me see, the... What is this? Well, the thermal power facility is 1,200 meters down. And inside an extensive natural rock formation. It's an extensive natural rock formation. This dude is cramping my style. So it is 1,200 meters down. Okay, for some reason I was getting 800. That's the other place. So we're actually probably pretty dang close. I don't want to give up. So what I'm going to do, though, is end the episode. So if you like the content, feel free to like and subscribe. And then I think we're going to continue our adventure down here. So, all right, guys. I will see you next time.